Hey beautiful people, it's Rikita and I'm back with another video. So in this video, you guys, I want to just do a recap on my video where I showed you guys how my credit score went up over 100. It's, at, it's actually over 155 points using this self account. Now, a lot of people, they try to figure out, Rikita, how can I get started? I need to start building my credit. I'm going to give you the game right now on how you can get started, especially when your credit score is in a 400, 500 is really, really low. Let me show you guys what you can actually do. Now, with the self account, let's kind of start from the basics with the self account. So when it comes down to self, you will sign up for this account and you can choose how much you want to actually pay per month because what you want to do is you're actually saving money and while you're saving money they're going to report into the credit bureaus so you can pick you can pick to pay between I think $25 and up to $150 per month. And as you're paying on your account, they're going to be reporting to the credit bureaus and it's going to be boosting your credit score. Now, here's the different payment plans right here. So you can sign up and pay $25 per month, and you can do that for 24 months, and then you'll get back $520 after your 24 months. Or you can decide to pay the $35 per month for 24 months, which is two years, you guys, and you'll get $724 back. Or you can also decide to that you want to pay $48 per month, which is what I'm doing. I'm doing the large builder here, and I pay that for a year and then I'm going to get $539 back and you can do an extra large builder if you want a higher loan and I'm going to show you a trick too you guys if you want a higher loan than just this one right here I'm going to show you how you can get a $2,500 one and you don't even have to pay $150 per month to get that but you can pay $150 per month and you'll get back $1,663. So this right here, you guys, this is going to really help boost your credit score up. A lot of people wonder, Rikita, okay, you say you boost your credit score 155 points. How? That was just over time of me having this account, plus, you know, fixing things on my credit, having other accounts, you know, just different things that you're doing to your credit. And it's going to boost your credit score up over time. Now, I'm going to do a pop up here where you can see somebody else. They actually got a, cr a great increase just from signing up. <laughs> like when it just reported, you guys, if you need to get like, over 40 points, that is amazing. If you need to boost your credit score fast, sign up for the self account. And I'll make sure I have that link down below. But let me show you my account. I told you guys I pay $48 per month. Now, 83% of my loans already been paid off. So, so far, I didn't say $443.88. So my next auto pay day, they're going to take it right out of my account. It's going to be September 19th. And they're going to take $48 and the auto pay is on. I do suggest that you guys pay this a little bit earlier than the due date. But I think you guys will be fine. Let's make sure. We'll look at my account and you will see. So let's go ahead and click on more details. So you'll see right here, I opened it a Every year I keep opening, 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 opening. So right here, I opened it, this account right here, October 19th. I, op I always open the same account. <laughs> I don't know why, but well, I know why. I don't want to pay, I don't want to do the 24 months at that low amount. And then on top of that, I don't want to pay $150 per month. That's like three times this amount. So I just picked $48. But they take the money out every month out of my account. Um, here is my see my full history so you can see every month they've been taking it out of my account on the 19th so yeah you can just set it up for that day or you can set it up a few days ahead of time if you want to just to make sure one thing you don't want to do is get this account and you don't pay it because late payments if you pay this late they're going to report to the credit bureaus if you are more than 30 days late and it's going to really drop your credit score and I don't want you to do that so another thing I want you to know about this self account too is if you're really trying to build your credit, they have a secure visa that you can get. And as you're starting to build, or as you start to build your credit with them, they're, all that money that you're paying into your account, like I said, I have over $400, I can use that money towards my visa card. So when I use that money towards my visa card, when it's time for me to get my payout, that money's not going to be there anymore. It's going to be in my visa card, which is good for those people that kind of want to spend some of the money now or they really need to build their credit right now, too. So if I want to get this card, which I really personally don't, I have credit cards now. I don't need to go to secure credit cards. If my credit score is high, well, since my credit score is high and if your credit score is high, I wouldn't suggest you get this secure one, but for those people that don't have at least four credit cards, they can't get a regular credit card. They need to start 
And then I suggest you go ahead and get that self credit card. So I will click right here where it says set up my car. Now to even be able to do this, you guys need to understand you need to make sure that you at least have $100 paid and you need to make sure that you made at least three months of payments. If you guys have that threshold, if you guys do that, then you'll have this option to get this card. Now don't forget, I did up to, I did over 400, I have over 400, I think it's $443 in my account right now. So they give me the option to get a card up to $425. But every time I make a payment on my self account, they can actually put that money into my credit card too. So that's the great thing too. If you want to start off with $100 and then I mean, every month you're getting an increase on your credit. So that's really good on your credit with your self visa. But I will just, um, if you guys wanted this, you'll put the maximum amount in there. And then you will go ahead and click get started. Now, this is the APR, you guys. The APR, the annual percentage rate is 23.99%. And then their annual fee is $25. So every year you're going to have to pay $25 for this card. But don't forget, if you don't have a credit card, I'm telling you, get this credit card and it's going to really boost your credit score. And you only have to start off with $100. So for those people that really don't have that much money, start off with that $48 account. Pay on that for three months and then get this secure one. And you're going to see your credit score really go up a lot, like a lot, a lot. But this is actually their Visa card. Don't forget the other one I showed you was just their regular account. And you have different options on what you um, want to pay. So you can just decide which one is best for you. Now, I told y'all that with this one right here, you got to pay $150 per month for 12 months. So you pay $150 every month to this account. If you really want to boost your credit score, you want to have your loan for a longer period. So you want to have your loan for, you know, a few years. So let me show you a trick that you guys can use. It's not really a trick. It's a different account that you guys can get where you can actually um, have more of a history. And when I say more of a history, it's going to keep reporting to the credit bureaus longer, which means that you're going to have a higher credit score possibly. Now, that account I want to talk to you guys about is the Credit Strong account. Now, with the Credit Strong account, they got personal and they got business. So for those people that's trying to do business credit, I'll go into that a little bit next. But let's go into the personal one first. So let's go ahead and view the pricing because that's like the most important part to me. So you have different ones that you want to do. So if you guys want to get a loan, it's going to report as a $1,000 installment account. Now, don't forget a thousand dollar installment account is, uh, it's it's like a little less than this one, but it's more than this one basically because this this only gonna be a five hundred thirty nine dollar um, installment account. All you have to do is pay fifteen dollars per month with them, and they're gonna report a thousand dollar installment account. And I always tell people try to have at least one or two installment accounts on your credit reports. And this one right here, this one's gonna report a twenty five hundred dollar one, which is way higher than this one. This one only $1,600, and all you have to do is pay $30 per month. Now, if you want to pay more per month, you can't pay it. They'll put that money towards the principal because these loans, they can actually have this on your credit for up to 10 years. So, you know, they can go ahead and stretch it on out. But in my opinion, don't try to have it for 12, um, don't try to have it for um, 10 years. That's a long time to me to have this type of account. You can start building your credit sooner than you can start having a better credit score sooner than that probably do it for about two years two or three years and you'll see a great increase in your credit score but yeah you can sign up for just paying thirty dollars per month for this account now you have to like the build and save you guys so they have different type of accounts that you guys can do other than just the ones i just showed you so if you guys just want to really start saving money you want to buy a house like these are the great accounts you guys can use too so that you can just start saving your money and on top of that you're building your credit so this is a these are some great options too and now like i told y'all i suggest y'all try to build your credit um you want to really start building up for about two years which is 24 months so i would think about doing this one here or i would think about doing this one here but it's up to you the other two they're going to stretch those payments out longer so you can go up to three years too so that's a really good option now they got the magnum one too if you want to you know get a higher amount reported on your credit reports, they're going to report a $10,000 installment account. And that's for $110 per month. That's still less than this one. So that's a great option for those people that want to get like a high installment account reported to their credit reports. And again, that's $110 per month. 
And then they have this one too for $55 per month and they're going to report a $5,000 installment account on your credit report. So, and don't forget, these are accounts where you're actually saving and you're going to build up to $5,000 and you're going to build up to $10,000. There is no prepayment penalty. So you guys can actually prepay these loans or pay them off quickly if you want to pay them off quickly to really boost your credit score. Now, for those people that's like, okay, Rakita, I see the personal, I know what to do, you know, pick one of these accounts. And even with the credit, um, let me go back to with the credit strong account, you guys can get two of these too. So you sign up for one, make your first payment, and then you can sign up for another one. So you can have two of these accounts. Now, when it came down to the self, you know, well, this is the credit card. When it come down to my self account, I'm not able to have two. You're only able to have one of them at you're only able to have one at a time. So keep that in mind when it comes down to this account. You're only allowed to have one at a time. So you can technically get a self account right now because you know, you know, that account is going to report good for you guys and it's going to boost your credit scores. So you can get a self and you can get a credit strong account, or you can get a self and then two credit strong accounts. But just know you can get two accounts with credit strong, or you can get both of them too. Don't worry about that. You can get, don't worry about, oh, should I just get one or the other? You can get self and you can get credit strong. So keep that in mind. Now let's go into this business credit. So introducing the um, credit strong business. So when it come down to the business credit, you guys, this is going to help you guys with your business credit because they have accounts on here that's really going to help build your credit. So if you guys want to know more about this and make sure you guys definitely come do your research they have a phone number and you see this chat box right here you can click that chat box and then they can start talking to you too now when i was on the page it automatically popped up and somebody started messaging me right away which was really amazing but start putting your information in and then you're going to see you're going to be able to start chatting like seriously Put your information or in, or I think you could just, oh, nope, they want you to put your information into yours. Maybe they knew me already, but put your name, your email address in, and put your message, and you could put personal or business support too. And then you can start chatting with somebody right away. It may take like a minute for them to come in, pop in, but it's not a robot. It's an actual person because I was asking specific questions that you should not formulate a robotic message about. But they answer those questions right away, which I think is really good. But you guys... You know, just look into this and look into their pricing for the business credit. If you're looking to build your business credit, it looks like they only have the, these two plans for you. So you can do the five year plan, or you can do the 10 year plan. They're going to report a $10,000 installment account onto your credit reports. And look, you guys, look, 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 look how much you have to pay monthly on them. So that's really nice, you guys. Now, if you have any questions, definitely let me know. But I'm going to have the links down below for the self account the credit strong personal and then a credit strong business. But if you have any questions, definitely go ahead and put them down in the comments. I'll be happy to answer them for you. And I'm really happy for those people that actually signed up and now they're getting all these great results. I really like the self and I love the credit strong. So if you guys have any questions, like I said, let me know. Bye-bye. <laughs>